Hey guys, welcome. So in this video, we're going to learn how to evaluate a simple double sum. Well, how do you do it? This is what you do. You begin always with everything by drawing a picture. So here, this is what you will do now. Look at the outer sum symbol. As you can see, y is first set equal to 1. So you come here to the y-axis, you set that equal to 1. Okay, remember, it's a double sum, which means you have an x and y coordinate space. Okay. So you set, you fix the outer sum at 1, and then the inner sum says jump over the x's like this, you see? So let's do that right now. We will have this. 1 and 1. So the first value here is 2, then to it we add 3, then to it we add 3 plus 1, which is 4. Okay, so that's the first sum, right? I fixed y at 1, and I went down across this row like this, and I added up the values according to this rule. Okay? And notice when I did that, with respect to x, y is held fixed at 1. It doesn't vary, okay? So make sure you understand that. In other words, you first set this value. Don't worry about the 2. You set that value. You perform the inner summation with the y fixed at 1 across the x's. And that gives you the sum. And then you advance the index on the y here up to 2. So that brings you over to y equals 2. And then you perform the procedure again, summing the points. So 1 and 2 is 3. 2 and 2 is 4. And then 3 and 2 is 5. There you go. So let's add these up here. So 2 and 3 is 5, then 4 is 9, 9 and 3 is 12, and 4 is 16, and 5 is 21. Okay, so the value of this double sum here is 21. And notice that when you draw a picture for yourself, it becomes infin <laughs> infinitely more clear. Okay, so remember, it's one thing to write out our symbols, another thing to know what the symbols mean. If you want to know what they mean, it's not impossible. You just have to draw the right kind of picture and the symbols come to life. So thank you for watching and have a ast an astonishing day. <laughs>